Bandicoot 2. Vortex strikes back. Press start to begin. Hello everyone, since Vengeance here and welcome to Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes Back, the second game in the Crash Bandicoot series and we're gonna start it. A couple of years ago, during I think the very first COVID um, lockdown, I played the first game and this is the end of the first game. We defeated the Dr. Neo Cortex and he falls down. <laughs> Crystals, of course. And he has a new plan for world domination. One year later. But Dr. Cortex, to reach full power, we need not only your master crystal, but also the remaining 25 slave crystals from the surface. How do you expect to retrieve them when we don't have any earthbound operatives left? You fool! Do you think I'm unaware of the situation? If we don't have any friends left on the surface, then we need to find an enemy. An enemy. And there we have him, Crash, Crash? and Coco. Crash? Crash, my battery is fried. Make yourself useful, big brother, and bring an extra battery for me. Now, as you can see, I have, uh, I am emulating this, um, so yeah. Welcome to Crash Bandicoot 2. This is Coco, his sister. This is the first time she appeared in the games, in Crash 2. She wasn't there in Crash 1, which is, of course, weird. There we had another female. Um, wait, was there a... I thought there was a thing there. We get another life, great. Of course, Crush has new abilities. He can crouch and crawl. And of course, he can do this. The belly flop. <laughs> so yeah, um, I've played the first game already. And that was a rage fest, so... This is gonna be a rage fest as well. Why is it going to be a rage fest? Because I am going to try uh, to get a 100%. So I'm gonna try and get all of the gems as well. That's the first level done. Somebody transported us. Well, well. If it isn't Crash Bandicoot, welcome. I apologize for the crude means used to bring you here, but I rather expect a written invitation would have been turned down. I need your help. Surrounding you are a series of five doors. Through each door lies a well-hidden crystal. The crystals look like this. Bring me the crystals, Crash. That is all I will say for now. We will speak again. You will speak again. So Cortex abducted us. That's not nice of him. Now, of course, Crash is not the smartest guy in the world. So yeah, he just does what he's being told. So let's go to the first level, Turtle Woods. Now, I remember playing Crash 2 at a friend's house because he had a PlayStation 1. I never had one. I, ha I started my PlayStation collection for two. Um, I don't really remember this one, but I vividly remember playing 1 and 3, mostly 3. Are you gonna see me um, evade or not touch any of the boxes? Because we're gonna get our first gem as well here. Our very first gem, a color gem, no less. So we don't touch anything. And I hope we don't die because our, we will have to redo the entire level. But we have to redo it and get all of the boxes. 
Now, this is, um, was a difficult one. Yes. Oh. Uh, I know I can do that. Points. I know I can do that. Okay, I failed. I think I'm gonna fail a lot of the sliding things. Okay, there's the crystal. We're gonna grab that. No. I'm gonna fail. There is a section in this level where you have to do like the slidey slides. And that's, well, going to be one hell of an ordeal. Because I am actually re-recording this episode, the very first episode, because I forgot to turn off uh, a setting in the Elgato Wavelink software. So my vo voice was double-tracked. So I'm using two tracks, one for the game audio, one for my voice. It was also on the game audio track. Well done, Crash! I Thank knew you! I could rely on you. Now listen carefully. These holograms are hard to maintain. During the course of my intellectual pursuits, I have stumbled across a force that threatens to destroy the world. Crystals are the only means of containing it. The fate of the world is at stake. It is imperative, therefore, that you bring them to me. No, Crash is not there. Okay, we're gonna redo this level, and this time we're gonna get all of the boxes. Now, how am I going to structure this little playthrough of Crash Bandicoot 2? Quite simple. Remember my Spyro playthrough? I did three levels per episode. I'm gonna do the same thing, and I am trying to not go over 40 minutes. Okay, that's just the structure. Now, I'm redoing this level, because that count as having uh, three levels. Oh, it's one of the three levels? No, it does not. It does absolutely not. Meaning I'm gonna do two more levels after that. We also know that there's gonna be... ...bosses, right? There's gonna be bosses. And I will count them as a level. Even though they're not as level based as... Um, Spyro game. This is the bit where I'm gonna fail a lot. I'm gonna lose some lives, actually. How many lives do I have? Seven. I press... Where do I start? All the way back? I pressed A. I swear I did. Oh, now I lost my mask. Great. And I never got a checkpoint either. Well, this sucks. Having to redo this section. My first uh, attempt, I had actually got to the checkpoint of that little thing, but no. Crash didn't uh, jump at in time. Is it because... I am emulating this and have enhanced the graphics a little bit? So let's be honest. Crash did not look like this. Not a... nothing at all. Okay, let's take... Hey. Okay, now I've got the checkpoint. Okay, now I hope I do this in 
correctly from the get-go. Points. Okay. Now this is a tricky section of this level. Because you see the nitrous crates, the nitro crates. Yes, oh, I did it first time. I did it first time this time. Okay. This time I did it first time. I'm not gonna complain. I am not gonna complain whatsoever. Absolutely not. I am glad I did that first try this time. I am definitely glad I did this first time. I got my mask back and I got another checkpoint. Oh yeah, and they changed some things for gem collection. Remember in the very first game, in order to get the gem, you had to get all of the boxes, but you also had to stay alive the entirety of the level. So, if you wanted to 100% this, uh, the first game, you actually had to do a literal no death run. How difficult is that? Okay, let's continue our merry way. That was a very f easy uh, first. Jump on it, Crash. Thank you. Bonus level. Okay, I still have my mask. Great. I had this little thing, which we couldn't touch. Okay. Grab the Boompa fruit. Okay, we got another mask. Is it Aku Aku or Uka Uka? No, Uka Uka is his evil twin brother from the third game, right? Okay. Okay, I thought I wouldn't be able to get that. But I did. Okay, maybe trying to do this with an Xbox controller is not the best uh, option. Give me a life. I have a feeling I'm gonna fail a lot because of the controller I'm using. Normally I should have the gem. Yes, there are 62 crates in this one. And I have the gem. The nitro crates, of course, count towards the box total. Let's do the TNT crates. Yes. That's great. We've got one crystal, one color gem, and one clear gem. And I love that dance. It's etched into my brain, in my memories. So, you were helping Cortex gather crystals, yet you have acquired a gem. Interesting. <laughs> Well, Crash, <laughs> know this, as long as you are allied with Cortex, you are my sworn enemy, and I will do anything in my power to, to, to stop you. <laughs> if the fate of the world is truly your concern, you must g g g gather the gems, not the crystals. If you obtain all 42 gems, I can use them to focus a laser, <laughs> a laser beam that will destroy Cortex and the space station he's created. Until then, I must use my forces to stop you from gathering. 
I feel like something was missing there. And he forgot to say something. He's trying to stop me from gathering the crystals. That's what he's going to try to do. So yeah, let's go for Snowgo and hang eight in this episode. First, Snowgo, where the red gem is, as you have seen. People familiar with this game know that something. Okay. When you have that, you're invincible. Come on. Wow. I wasted my mask on trying to get that one box. Oh god. Please don't crash. Ah, crap. Oh god. Crap again! I lost my mask! That ain't good. Anyway, here's the first checkpoint. No, that's just certain death. Let's try to grab as much Wumpa fruits as possible in case I die. My first death. No, my second death. Really? I need to gather the lives. Could you not slide any further? Fine. I'll jump on the seals then. Like the maniac I am. See? Points. <laughs> Okay, we have another checkpoint. There's the red gem. How can we get it? Well, actually... We can't. Not even with the high jump. So... Oh god, do not get flattened. Oh god. Do not get flattened, boinks. In order to get the red gem, we have to actually access another level, which we won't see until episode 3, maybe? Oh, I thought I would make that jump. Of course, lives are important. So we gather all of the Wumpas. So we have to do this. Be very, very patient. Gather the Wumpas. Points, points. How many lives do I have? 15. Points. Aha, mask. Umga. Checkpoint, and don't forget to do this, or else it won't happen. No, or else you won't get the clear gem. 16 lives, okay. In the Insane Trilogy remakes, it actually shows you how many boxes there are in the level. Which is a nice touch, of course. Let's grab the crystal. No touching. Bye. So yeah, it's a shame that... They didn't... Um, no. But they don't show this in the original trilogy. Or in the original games. Okay. We gotta go back. 
I think that's it. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Normally, we should have the clear gem after destroying these boxes. I should actually note this down. How many boxes there are in each level. Because I've made, like, uh, so some sort of mind map on an app in the on my tablet. Uh, I'm detailing about how I get everything, where there are death routes, how to actually get the gems, the colored gems, and all that, so yeah. Maybe I should note how many boxes there are for the clear gem, or the box gem. Okay. So, we didn't get the red gem, but that's normal. We need to go to another level for that. Okay. Hang 8. There's two gems there. Um, of course, the crystal, which we always have to get. And there's two gems there. We have a box gem, and then we have a gem. Another gem, but I'm not gonna focus on the second gem yet. I'm gonna focus on the box gem. And then I'll say what the other gem is going to be. Or how do we how we get the other gem? Okay, I like to play it safe here. Even though I can go a little bit faster because I've played through this section a couple of times in my uh, in the first recording session. Oh god. Nope. Oh! Nah! You see, you see a timer. I'm not gonna focus on the timer now. I'm gonna focus on the box. So I'm gonna take my time. Grabbing every single box. Bye. The timer is of no concern right now. So the timer is actually saying finish the level under this time and you get the other clear gem. Somehow I didn't get the timer when I got the checkpoint for um, when I recorded this first. Weird. It also doesn't show up when you die. So maybe I died, but I just can't remember I did. Anyway, like I said, my focus is on the boxes. Yes. That's gonna be 20 lives. At least. 21 lives. Let's try and keep them. As you can see, we have the blue gem path in this level already. The music is rather nostalgic, but like I said, I will go... No, no, no. <laughs> I almost um, fell into the water. Crush can't swim. But that's an issue. No. Yes, like that. Okay, let's continue. Let's take our sweet time. For certain stuff. Oh god. I thought I got hit. Don't do that, Crash. Okay. Let's line them up. Oh. We have a checkpoint. Oh god. Okay. Ignore the ramps for the moment. Mm -hmm. Okay, now you can go for the ramps. 
Because you first have to go and touch that. Okay. Oh god. That is not the way it was supposed to go. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Or not. Well, I'm getting the hang. Hey, I pressed... I pressed B. No, no, no. Get back there. Okay. Nope. Yes. Oh, God. And then this is the end of the blue gem route. Which we can safely ignore when we come back to this level. Of course, the blue gem route is essential in getting the clear gem. Did we do the bonus round already? I think we did. Okay. Checkpoint. Great. Let's take it easy. There's no rush. Okay, there's a bit... No, there's no rush. Not... Oh god, I almost got hit by that mine. Do not get hit by the mines. I didn't get hit. Once, okay. This was a no death run, great. And we got the clear gem for all of the boxes. Which is nice and all. Okay, we have three crystals now. And one, two, three, four gems. So we're gonna go for the fifth gem in Hang 8, in which we have to do the level in a certain amount of time. Which we will do, of course. Three crystals. Not bad. I see you are getting the hang of it. I need to conserve power. I will communicate with you again after you retrieve the fifth crystal. How many crystals did he say I didn't hear it correctly? Or properly, or correctly. Okay, we're gonna do this again. And this time I'm gonna rush through it, because I got all the boxes. Right? Of course, let's take our time getting up there. Oh god, of course. Go, 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 go. 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 No, 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 get in, get in. Get the checkpoint. Don't care about the bonus level. We're, we just gotta go. We don't care about any of the other things. Get the checkpoint and just go. Come on. Come on. We're not gonna make it. No, we're not gonna make it. What? Ah, crap. Okay. You know uh, what I have to do, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut it out until I've done it and you'll see uh, get me, me getting the gem, of course. So I'll see you when I've done it, I guess.
Okay, we got the second gem. It took me a couple of tries. But damn! I don't know how this uh, mechanic functions. I mean, one time I got there at the checkpoint and I had 53 seconds left. And in my final run I had one minute of time. So I don't know how that one functions. Okay, we've done three levels. Turtle Woods, twice. Snow Go. Hang 8, in which we which we also did twice, because we needed the other clear gem. Next up it's gonna be the pits and crash dash, which both only have one crystal and one gem. Of course, each level has only one crystal, but they both have one gem. Box gems. Okay, so that's for next episode. Thank you for watching. I hope you will enjoy Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes back and i'll see you in the next episode of this nostalgic magnificent game bye bye